Hello everyone and welcome back to uh, Eastward. I am Ranyako and today I guess we're gonna look for some king crab. Yeah, should not be much of a problem. Hopefully. Oh, hello there. Aha, you found me again. Since your nose is a squash man, you must be quite the adventurers. Here, take this. Ooh. Let this be a token of our friendship. Whenever you find something, you tell all about. Secrets are only secrets when people know them. Yay, more HP. I seem to have caught a cold. Mm. Hopefully, that doesn't disrupt too much. Um, Royal Rice Plate from work. A newly reopened dragon market. Truly a recipe for self indulgence. Who are you? Snacks, snacks, packs of snacks, get yourself a snack pack today. Can we? Uh, Chinese burger. Yes, it's literally used to have one of each. Anyway, you. What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? Up through the moon. Chevy, yeah, the cat is looking for you. Little Sammy, your great beautiful barba papa. You gotta hear me out. The captain sent me to pick up the shipment of crab, and I came straight here like a right old lived out they did. Only what you know. The damn ship was locked up tight as, as a port the, the rear, and the marine stupidest flung the coop like damn fools left me looking like a fool. Marine stupidest? What's a, a, a marine stupidest? I'll tell you what they are and I'll tell you to your what. You're those damn prayers and is what they are from Brotherhood Construction. They told me they'd help me not the best class, like creme de la creme. But not what? But now what? If Chevy doesn't bring home the bacon, the bacon's wrong, gonna bring home Chevy's. You sort of beer. Okay then. It's over here. Yep, sounds about right. I'm close to the boat and don't ask me why. If you have to ask anyone, I'll stop those two bosses over there. Came in morning about jackpot nonsense and have been drinking themselves senseless since last night. Now they're passed out on my floor like a couple dead oxes. So, so there those two words, eh? Guess I'll take over for Monk today and sap those two chumps into shape. Ouch! Wowee! Uh, why'd you hit me, bro? It wasn't me, it was Mac! Uh, why'd you sap us, mister? You two forgot something important, did ya? Money, we paid you the money for the drinks, didn't we? We did, didn't we, bro? The King Crafts! We forgot about the King Crafts! 
We're done for. Come on, bro. We've got to mother ourselves to the dragon market. Lord, do you recognize those two? Slaughter, bro. Anyone who'd be drinking in broad daylight isn't anyone with a sociopath. Ha. I was too can to do anything right. Anyway, you guys better hurry to the dragon market yourselves. The man for those king crafts is about to go through the roof. Accurate? We're so sorry, Chevy Sorpal. I'm oh, sorry. Listen, Finn, you damn fools nearly lost Chevy's job. We're so sorry. Super sorry. I don't want your stories. I want your asses hauling that crab up to the shop. Let's see. Uh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Something, man. I knew I could count on you to the utmost of mercy. Big job to you, Nesamis. I'm heading back to the Kingcraft to make sure those imbeciles don't try anything else. If you got time, you stop by your stuff, you hear? You got our compensation creable with your name on it, a plus. I cannot do this by side well. Still the amount we have uh, the amount of everything we have makes me think we missed something. Eh, we probably did. But not much sense on dwelling on that right now. I promised inside inside, which done. The Capitan wants to give you a whole bushel of king crabs. I knew you'd be back in a jiffy. What say you prepare to tantalize your tongues with the flesh of the king? I've got a whole bushel full of fire right here. You already gave us all these grass? Without your help, these king crafts would have been meeting with Davy Jones. Suffocated to death, they would have been. Judemi was, was thanking you. Take him, take him more. Yay, king crab. That looks kind of weird, doesn't it? Yeah, we've got the king crabs now. I saw right back to the rocket mansion. Okay, what's gonna happen this time? He gave us three attempts, so clearly we're going to need three attempts. Yeah, and hurry, he's gonna be here any minute. Yeah, the dog, Pilgrim Snow. Oh no, we don't have enough ginger. Oh no. I'll buy it my pudding. Crap, 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 crap. The crafts, the crafts are getting away, John. Give it to me. <clears throat> okay, then. That's, uh... That's all of them. Time to take the crafts back to you. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, and I got all the crafts. Okay, that... I mean, that seems to be working. Something smells. Something smells good in here. 
Have you guys already started cooking? Hey, it's totally going down this time. You own some! Oh, the troop. The troop is done for. You must help us. If tonight's show isn't a rousing success, we'll. we'll. be forced to leave New Dam City. Don't sweat it, the Rocky Knight Legion is on the job. Rocky Knight Legion? Sweet! Sounds just like airborne. <laughs> I started up while walking through the door. Pretty good, don't you think? Don't worry, Jasper. The Rocky Knight Legion is gonna make everything right again. Uh, Alba is gonna ruin the food, isn't she? You good for nothing. I need that money, and I need it today. You can't just race around like that. At least give us a bit more time. Hmm. You two bit hack jobs. I could give you ten years, and you'd never pay back that money. If you don't pay me what you owe me, well, you better just start packing your bags. You hear me? Out. You'll be out. What are you looking at? Out of my way. Fair, my friends, I have returned. And look who I brought. It's over already. We're finished. No ifs and our buts. We don't pull off a miracle tonight and we're out of here. Better to start thinking about what we'll do after we leave. Yeah, but you guys can't go. Then I'll never be able to eat your ice cream again. Sorry, little bone. It's not like we wanna go. I must admit, had we known this would be the conclusion, perhaps we would never have come to the city at all. Quite, all of you. What kind of performer abandons their own audience? Yes, first got a point. I can't agree. A minute. How can we just abandon our ending? Oh, then, huh? But... So what are we waiting for? Let's practice like the like the Vegas. Then show this city just what the Fantasia train is made of. The worry isn't unwarranted. If we abandon a show in our current state, there will be nothing short of a disastrous disaster. You must help us. There must be something we can do. Assemble! Earth! Wind! Fire! Oh no no, again from the top. Uh, excuse me? Is there any way perhaps I could be a fan? Huh? Oh, it's just you, Jan. Well, don't tell me you wanna join, do you? Um, or not quite sure that would work. Perhaps if we got her a change of attire, you know, to uh, exaggerate things a little. A brilliant idea! Yeah, but where are we gonna get something like that? We don't even got money to put food on the table! Oh ho ho! I've got just the ticket, the perfect costume! the second floor of the coin palace. You'll find some... Uh, Butterfernalia. We 
it will tell you to grab it first, do you? If you're so familiar with this photo for Nani, why not fetch it for yourself? I um, have my reasons, you know. Besides, we've got to practice, right, boys? And you. Didn't you just got there the other day, Tom? Maybe he was looking for a question for you. Oh, no, no. The way I remember, he was going to meet someone. What was her name again? That one woman behind the counter. Oh, uh, Lily, was it? That's right. Lily. How did things go with her anyway? Would you two shut up already? I think they didn't go very well. Anyway, it's a simple job. You guys should be fine. You'll find the stuff on the second floor of the corn palace. Should be three pieces total. You can't miss them. Just leave it to us. This way again. All right. No clue. This mask is must be, it must be part of the costume. You stop his left, they've got a be around here somewhere. But they're pretty weak. Just one piece left. Yeah, I figures he would be right there. Got a bit this way. That's it, all the pieces of the costume. Come on, Jan, let's head back. That couldn't possibly go wrong. Also, that was a torture room. I'm so innocent. <laughs> hmm. Did I ever interact with this fridge? <clears throat> People are a lot more keen on remembering the times they won money. But when they lose money, they just hang their heads and walk away. Yeah, sounds about right. That's... that's people all right. No... Can I just... No reason to delay any longer? Ho oh, ho! You folks did it! I knew asking you to do this was the right choice! This... this is what you want me to wear? This a bit... Um, embarrassing, don't you think? Now you say it's embarrassing, but these kind folks went all the way to the coal, coin palace to get it for you. You were the one who wanted to help. Mm. Truly, these delicate garments could we but losing the chance to adorn your form, my lady. Oh, okay, just uh, give me a, a moment, please. Oh, before me, maggots! I think she liked it. On your knees! But, uh, this is brilliant! I think he just got white. Did I say you could speak, worm? 
I am the Beetle Queen. I can't thank you enough for retrieving this costume for me. Yes, perhaps some sort of reward is in order. <laughs> no need to worry, it won't be anything too painful. Just leave two nice performance to me. The men in this city won't know what hit them. Yes, ready your stakes, boys, because tonight the dance shall rise. Oh, I get it. Wow, Honey Young was so eloquent. Who is this young you speak of? I am the Beetle Queen! Okay then. Well, hey there, girls to listen to the ramblings of an old muscle head. I'm this troops all-star pitcher, you know. Why would a circus troop need a pitcher? I'm glad you asked. Heh, <laughs> my fastball is one of the most popular as you know. Throw it again, Cage. Raging Cage, the star shooter! That's what they call me. Who don't get enough of my white and red streaks? Then our business and our endings began to wane. I found myself pitching less and less. To the point where I was losing my touch. A rusty pitcher. Could it get much worse? But what could I do? I didn't have anyone to practice with. My fast, my fast balls used to well fast. Damn! Why don't you give it a try? Huh? You could help him. You know. And you got what it takes to hit my fastball? Yes! Well, I'll be. Someone finally willing to go up against my fastball. Then, let's get things fired up. That is indeed fast. Gotta get the timing right anyway. Wow, wowie! I got it! This feeling! This feeling! Just like all that passion, all that pan fried pizzazz! Pass straight into my palm! That's the stuff, that's the feeling I've been missing! Krauss will be shouting my name again tonight. Okay, anything else? You... Um... Why do you look so sad? Mine is a tale of woe, I'm afraid. The name's Torkus. And I'm Malorcus. No one asked you. I'm a clown here in the troop. As if that weren't obvious, I used to have one and called the boxes of fright. Right is right. Those creepy dolls you had popping out of the boxes were enough to haunt kids' dreams. You should have seen all the complaints we got from parents. That's why I'm changing it. Because I have a new act now, a real showstopper. I call it the Slice Right. More like the slightest wrong. Where this guy is concerned, his hands are as slow as molasses. Even a baby would be able to see through the awkward mess he calls an act. I don't need to hear that from you. And yet I know he's right. My hands just aren't nimble enough to pull off the trick. Let me see, maybe I can do something to help. Really? You'd watch my act? Oh, joy of joys. Don't be too harsh on him. His pride's as brittle as an actual. Here it goes. Not too hard to this point, right? Now, watch this. It's already a jumble, is it? But wait, there's more. Where do you think the ball is? Is that your final answer? Are you absolutely, completely sure? Oh, well, 
You were right. It's true, I really am awful like this. My hands are just too slow. Oof. Maybe I should just give up. Oh well, that's any way for trying to help. Feel free to come back anytime. I'm always here. Alright, watch carefully now. I won't hold back this time. Damn me too. Okay. Am I supposed to get it wrong cor on purpose? Suddenly on the right side. Wrong. <laughs> I did. I really did. Maybe I'm not horrible at this. I'll even give you a chance to try again. Here it goes. Do I, do I just need to get it wrong multiple times, I guess? Fine. Let's get it wrong again. feel positively electric. I could fool anyone. How utterly splendid! I knew you two would pull through. Tonight's carnival is going to be a smashing success, I just know it. However, there is one thing. We still need you to do. Yes, a job of utmost importance. An important job? What is it, huh? What is it? Smile, son, smile. Too much fashion hair to smile. <laughs> Welcome. Welcome. Ah, it's mine. Well, if it isn't her majesty's little bee, you're going to the carnival too. No, I have to work. Aren't you responsible? Ha oh, ha, oh, good luck with that. Welcome. <laughs> so, how ruined this epigram? No, taking the stage. Kitty, the precious jungle club. Entertainer, El Tigre. Can we go watch now? Can't, gotta work. Welcome. 
welcome. Well, hello there, Sunny. Hello there, Circus. Can you get some? Weird game. I'm not the fastest arm this side of the dam, but still armed wonder raging Kai Shorsong. I wanna watch. You gotta work. But it's so boring. Can't I just watch for a bit? Ah, John, our caput. Finally remembered, huh? Overcooked. How disappointing. If they'd actually been able to recreate that crapwood, <laughs> I might have actually been forced to throw in the tower. It seems Lady Luck is on my side. Ha 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 ha! Bill. is not gonna know what hit him. He never did. In a million years, expect that John could make his beloved victim captain. Lovely. Here comes my migraine. Wait, is that cigars me? I smell. Bill is already here. You haven't touched anything, have you? If you sabotage all of Yom's hard work. Oh, you've done a far better job at that than I ever could. Hey, you can't just walk out of here. This is the big damn crapboard, your favorite. Yes, yes, well, let me just ask you one thing, will you? What's the most vital thing to remember for a successful crab pot? Uh, why, just the right amount of time in the pot, of course. Oh, oh no! I've seen enough. Though I am a bit hungry for some crab now. I'll need to have my chef cook me a replacement. left. Are you even taking this seriously? You've yet to produce even a single dish I can actually eat. If you had time to go play around at the circus, why not put the sides to good use and actually think of something good? Oof. Next time, next time you're going down. Come on, John, what's the fucking sign? We can still uh, eat this, right? If you don't have any taste buds, maybe. But it was only barely overcooked. It can't be that bad. Do you not remember the time you ate those mushrooms? Playing around at the circus, huh? What does he think he is, huh? We weren't playing around. Uh, oh, what's that smell? Uh, smell? You mean the crab pot? Yeah, is this your crab pot? How did it turn out so... 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 You, need, you didn't add something weird with it, did you? Hey, my cooking isn't that bad. It's just overcooked. These crabs are a little, um, delicate. It's really easy to overcook them. I guess we'll have to try again tomorrow, then. I wouldn't if I were you. If I knew Lee, he's already gorging himself on crab pot right now. And without a spark of pure, unadul unadulterated childlike surprise, I just don't know if it will have the same effect. But then what are we gonna do? <clears throat> what are you waiting for? Just knock. But, but, but this is the princess's house. How is it? Well, well, we're here to see John and Sam. Could, could we come inside? Of course you may. Just, um... Don't let the smell bowl you over. Hi, ah, it's you guys. 
Holy wow, sir, this is the princess's house? It's enormous! Huh? Everyone from, from the troop is here too. Somebody slammed me with a dead fish. What is that smell? I'm having visions of Jasmine's socks. Uh, that's just our crab pot, our um, slightly overcooked crab pot. I thought the princess's house would be pink. Yeah, I'm smelling like cookies and, and fairy dust or something. Wait! I want to once your pitiful appraisal. A show? How did the show go? It was... A booming success! It was? Oh gosh, oh well. And that means you guys, can, you guys can stay, right? You don't have to leave. Indeed, which just leaves your little problem. A little problem? Yes, Jasper already filled us in. You said the two of you have gotten yourselves embroiled in a little wager with Lee. You folks sure got balls of steel going up against T. Lee. All you need on city is the most courtastic crime lord. A real son of Snake, that one. At any rate, it seemed like the perfect time for our troop to step, it on, step in and save the day. Well, it's not really that bad. Uh, it's, it's, it's so cute. Maybe it's not really that bad. <laughs> you could say the same for her body. <laughs> what I meant to say was, um, gifts. We brought gifts. Just to help you wipe that smoke green off Lee's face. You mean all of this is for us? Holy cow, this is amazing! That is quite a lot of food, yes. Is, is this snow plain cactus? Wow, I've never seen this in the flesh before. Stupendous, the princess has such a keen intuition. And is this cheese? It looks a little weird. It's cheese from my hometown, but not just any cheese. This is hard rock cheese. And these are called fried shrooms. They're so good, they'll give you a fright. <laughs> what? No good? They look like normal mushrooms. This. This. This is amazing. Now we're gonna win for sure. Quick, John, we gotta get cooking. It smells so good. It certainly looks more appetizing than our previous attempts. But I still can't help but feel we were missing that yes factor, that ultimate clincher. I found them, I found them! Huh? It's Jasper. Allow me to introduce the great, the brilliant, William the Merchant! Oh, and his assistant, Daniel. We meet again. You guys know each other? We first met on board Karen. We also gave them the glassy berries yesterday. That's not suspicious at all. Don't, don't worry, we're not trying to, to trick you this time. This time. Let me do the talking, please. After hearing that our magnanimous manufacturers had found themselves in a crisis, we thought it only right that we offer a recompense of sorts. And the suspicion broke loose. Let's just hear what they have to say. Fine ladies, ever heard of Quake Valley? You mean the dump? Yes, yes, it has developed that hmm, alias as it were. There's a lot of earthquakes there. Some people call it Quake Valley. 
And not just any place, you see? If my intel is correct, this place are caused by a rather rambunctious creature known as the Templar Fish. Yeah, but that thing's not edible. An astute observation, my dear princess. I save you done some research of your own. Hehe, <laughs> well, mostly thanks to Easy. But have any of you ever given any thought as to why that fish causes its trem tremulous trumbles? We're still not really sure. Maybe it's got an itch, and, and, and because it doesn't have any hands, it can scratch it. An excellent mm, hypothesis, and you may be a scientist yet. What a fair conclusion, I'm afraid. No, the reasoning behind this is a bit more glutinous. Did you know that fish are quite sensitive when it comes to air waves? Even the slightest tremor will send them hopping and skipping atop the water's surface. Yeah, but what does that, what does that have to do with anything? It has everything to do with everything. For you see, our good man Dyson friend uses these quakes to tie on, it on his design brethren. What a smart fish! Indeed, but what's next is key to this whole affair. The bulk of this fish's diet, you see, consists of a fish so delicate, so delectable, so dreamy, why you'd never want to partake of any other fish again. The Golden Valley Snapper. Yeah, 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 we know all that. That thing's basically primo when it comes to gourmet cuisine. They could call them balisna bears smells like lilies and taste as sweet as a honey. Its flesh has a tantalizing texture that dances in your mouth. And not only that, it's full of nutrients too. It's the cream of the crop when it comes to fish. For quick valid stamon in the rough. This fish sounds amazing! The only problem is it's very crafty. You can't catch it like a normal fish. Only the, the Templar fish has ever been able to catch it. Putting two and two together then, it would seem our task is simple. If we find the Templar fish, we find our snapper. Wait just a minute here. Who I would have agreed to any of this yet? Of course, whether you choose to set forth on this venture is completely up to you. Yet, I cannot be the only one thinking that your choices are, shall we say, limited. Hmm, I've got to admit, I've got a pretty, pretty fierce hankering for Snapper now. <laughs> I've always wanted to give that golden fish fiend a try. And, and, Wake Valley sounds like a super cool place. Marvelous, marvelous. Then it seems you've already made your decision. Shall we meet, say, tomorrow morning at the big station? I do hope you all have a wonderful night's nice sleep. Sweet dreams. Okay then. And with that we have our final plan. I hope you'll have fun. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.